Hi guys, welcome to my channel. And today, no, we are not going to keep these on. But guys, how cool are these masks? I think they quite suit me right now. So guys, <laughs> I got these masks. I don't know when I'm going to wear them, but Zach is taking so much fun out of these masks that, um, yeah, I think he's getting the hang of Halloween. Right guys, the weather absolutely sucks today. Gonna hear a lot of rain on the roof. For you ASMR guys, you'll probably enjoy this natural um, raining sound. So guys, uh, my dad's left early this morning and um, my monitor is gonna get handed in today about half 12. I honestly don't think there's an issue here. Um, I think <coughs> my hat just does that arrhythmia thing and the fast beating thing anyway, so. Hopefully, fingers crossed, our system will be set to go next week. So guys, we've had a delivery today and it's one of my favorite deliveries ever. And it's a kill star, yay. So guys, um, this kill star is not just based around me this time. It's Zach's seventh birthday and he's been begging and begging and begging me for duality. So, um, He's seen the, well, he's seen me on the computer looking at the two for one at Killstar for the teddies. And he was like, oh, mummy, look at that teddy bear. I really want that teddy bear. And Zach used to absolutely hate teddies. Hate, hate, hate. The only teddies he ever liked was like the weird and quirky ones. He's got like um, Sparky and Victor, like Monsters Inc. He's got like um, Soxy Beasts that have been made like monsters. Um, he likes the weird and wonderful teddies. He's got skelly teddies, which are like, they are teddy bears, but they have a mask over them, but when you pull it off, they're like skeletons. He's got them, he's got the the monster teddies that have the jaw, which I've got the cat one over there. So I had to take advantage of the two for one offer. I'm really miffed because I really wanted to get the cat and the other one for like my grandkids. But it's like 10, 20, it's 40 pound there. And then what on, on top of what I've got, this order only, it already came to like 50 pound. I used my honey code guys and it took five pound off. So honey code is great for some things, not for others. So before I start this guys, I'm gonna stress the birch box to clear off the, what has happened. I, obviously I didn't know. So basically, when I picked the two for one offer, I went to the, the cash point, not the cash point, the checkout, and <coughs> I typed in woohoo, and that was great, but my honey code generates a code anyway. So what I didn't realize that my woohoo code was overwritten by the, um, the honey code because the honey code was greater than the woohoo code. So, Initially, I thought I was getting a good deal. I thought I was getting two boxes for £7.60. In actual fact, I wasn't. It cancelled the two for one and just gave me September's box for £7.60. So some people, that's an amazing offer. But I didn't want this box for me. I'm not interested in any more subscription boxes of beauty. So I was really miffed off when they only brought me one. <coughs> and I don't really want anything out of Birch Box. So the September box... <coughs> it would have been great for one of my girls and maybe one of the old boxes would have been good for Leah so I'm really miffed off because I've got one box and nothing to give to Leah so <coughs> I'm really sorry guys if I keep coughing I've got GERD and I'm struggling to hell with coughing at the minute so I've said to Birchbox I didn't realise your checkout should have said you can only use one cord and you didn't so it, it checked out too as far as what I thought and um, cancelled it out. So I've said, I want to send this birch box back. I don't want it. It's no good to give one to, to my daughters and not the other. I know I could just go online and just buy another box anyway, but that September box is no good for my 16 year old. So I don't know what to do guys. So I'm either going to send it back or I'm just going to give it to my daughter and maybe have a look and order something else for Leah out of like a makeup subscription box. Anyway. Let's get stuck into this one, guys. So it looks massive, but it's probably because the, uh, is it creature? Creatures are so big. But I'm excited, <laughs> really excited. Right, so first thing I can see, guys, I'm gonna pull out 
is my first creature. Oh, look at these! My first creature, and it says I am cute as hell. So guys, look at these bloody bomb bags that they come in. Zach will want to take this to school on his bomb bag because that's amazing. So it says creatures, and I'm as cute as hell. So guys, I love the bags and these. I'm going to wrap them up for Zach just like this. So Zach's got two teddies for his birthday. We spoil them on his birthday and we spoil them at Christmas because throughout the year he, he doesn't get anything. So, well, he does get the odd things for good behaviour and stuff, doing well. But he misses out, so... Oh, he's going to go mental. So this first one that I can see... Does it say what... So this is the Hydra. And Zach loves everything quirky and I just thought he would absolutely love this. Oh, wow, look at this. So guys, this is Hydra. Oh, how bloody cute is this? So it has the coffin-shaped tag and it says, Creatures, I'm cute as hell, where I also came from. Right, guys, so let me put my glasses on so I can read it. This is so cute. Guys, it's like velvet as well. All velvety suede. Leather kind of wings. Leather horns. <coughs> this is brilliant. I love it. So it says, uh, for creepy kids age three and up. So we're all right with that one. Um, these have come from Los Angeles as well, guys. So that's brilliant. So it comes from Draco Distribution Limited in Glasgow. All right. Live fast, shop online. So... It says, I can't really read that. If I lose my hair, I just grow a few more. <laughs> Brilliant. So he's got lots of ears. So that is Hydra, guys. Look at it. How cute is that? No, it's, it's been parceled up in that bag. So once it's left to sit for a while, all that will set in place. Zach will absolutely love this. He will love it. I can't wait to see his little face. Guys, we will film him opening his presents on his birthday and I'll, I'll vlog it for you because Zach is autistic and he appreciates everything. He's so excitable at presents. Christmas and birthdays is his only favorite time of the year and he loves, absolutely loves Halloween. He woke up this morning, came down and went, oh wow, it's Halloween. I've started decorating some of the, some of the house. I'll do the rest next week, but. So that's Hydra guys, that's my first item. Now, the second item is not actually parceled, and it does look smaller than I actually thought. So, this is Duality, which is the one he wanted. I'm going to take it out of the bag, guys, because of safety reasons. We'll get rid of the bag. So, it's actually smaller than I actually thought, but that is cuddle size. Wow. Oh, I want to keep it. I think Zach will let me borrow it. I'll let me borrow him now and again. So, this is Duality, which is the two-headed bear. Um, Siamese twins is what they call them. So it says duality is always... What? Duality is always secretly uni unity. Oh, so this is duality. So what I couldn't read on there was Hydra. So again, I love the little tote. I will take these off, guys, and stick them on my unit because I think the, the label's absolutely brilliant. So it's got a little tail between two. Two legs, two arms, two little balls with the pentagram on. I got that right pentagram pentagram no it's pentagram little kind of tongue and teeth <coughs> and this it's really really soft guys really soft oh this is so cute so guys i paid 24.99 and the reason why i did that this was 19.99 hydra was 24.99 so obviously you pay for the most expensive one if i had two at 19.99 i would have paid 19.99 because I had Hydra, I got this one free at $19.99 and that one was $24.99. I will order some more for Christmas for Zach, without a doubt. Without a doubt. He doesn't want the cat. I know that. Um, he's made that very, very clear. But I think I may get him the... There's a new one that's come out. It looks like the Egyptian one. I may get him one of them. Or I may get him the bat. He really does want the bat, but it's sold out. Um, I don't know. We'll see. But that's that one, guys. I'm going to see if I can fit Duality in with Hydra. So they're both in the same bag. Does that make sense? And then just wrap it up as one. Because I think he'll be... There you go. It's a good size bag, this, guys. It's amazing. I think I'll keep it, actually. Right. Next thing that I can see. Um, what the heck's this? Oh, yeah. So this is my next item, guys. 
Now this was in a sale item. The other reason I'm buying sale items at the minute because it's before Christmas and I can't really afford to buy anything like properly from there. But I think next year I'll start buying some shoes, and some clothing and let's get some proper hauls done. Yeah, I think so. So I do want a lot more bags. I've never been big on bags, guys. <coughs> I've had all the Ann Stokes bags and I got rid of them all. Now, the reason why I get rid of them all, and it may seem stupid, I've got severe back disability, and believe it or not, certain bags cause extra pain in my back. So anything that's too heavy, I can't particularly use. So I do like little rucksacks. <coughs> I used to have the coffin bag, um, but unfortunately it was too heavy on my back and got rid of it. But I do carry a lot of stuff, guys, so it might not just be the bag, it might be what I carry in the bag. So um, I got this bag. Maybe for the night out. Comes in these bags, which I think are absolutely great. It keeps them fresh, put them away. And it has tissue paper around it. And it's bigger than I actually thought, this bag. So this is this lovely round moon-shaped bag. And it says it's the Luna Morte handbag. This was $14.99, guys. They did have another one that had a pentagram in the middle. I'm going to get that one next. I do want the spell bag as well. Um, my birthday is straight after Christmas and my husband says what do you want for your birthday because he, he treats me like a lot for the birthday <coughs> so I've asked for some Killstar shoes and a bag for my birthday so look out for that one next year so it's quite a good size guys you could use this as a vanity bag to be completely honest with you I probably wouldn't because I have got a lot a lot of vanity bags I will definitely use this as a bag on my night out because when I go out, I like to have my phone in there. I do like to have like my makeup and stuff in there. I do like to bring my deodorant, my hairbrush. So it's a very, very good size. It does have straps, guys, that you attach to here. And it's like, um, what's it called? PVC, not PVC, is it PVC? I forgot what it's called. The PVC, it's PVC, isn't it? But that's that, guys. So as you can see, you've got your, your moon and then you've got your skull. I love it. I love how it, um, intertwines to each other if you just look at it that way and then you look at it's kind of weird it's, it makes your eyes go funny so that was that one guys so that was 14.99 i'll pop the link on below if they have got any of these left it's worth it because it's a very good size bag so that was that guys <coughs> um next we have this one and these two right guys they did email me about one of the items i ordered and said because i ordered an xxl and the only reason I ordered an XXL is I found that some of Killstar's clothing is a bit weird on their sizes. Is it 11 o'clock? Yeah, it is. And he's keeping on the time. Because um, I got like the, the medium t-shirt that says, yeah, yeah. And it was quite, it's quite tight on the arms, but not so much on the body. So I thought I'd get an XXL for this. So I definitely fits because I got an XL on the crop top that I got with my pentagram pants. That didn't fit and I ended up selling that, guys, and I got my money back for it. But I've still got my leggings because they do fit me. So I grabbed this top on the sale items, guys. I can't quite remember how much this was. So here's my Killstar envelope. And then inside it has my order. So it says... Um, hey, it doesn't have the price of my top on here. Okay. It doesn't actually have my top on here, which is kind of weird because it has like this item that I'm going to show you now. And it's got like a, the duality and the hydra and the bag, but it doesn't have this. And it's also got the total price of 66 95 How have they worked that out then? 10 20 30 It wasn't that price, guys. It was £50. So I don't know what they've done there. That order's a little bit... So I don't know how much this was, guys. I think it was maybe £9.99 or something. Or maybe less. I don't really know. I could not tell you off the top of my head. So I decided to order this top to make it up to that price so I could get free delivery. Uh, so they contacted me said they didn't have XXL. So I said, I'm quite happy with an XL and you've got it. And then um, that's what they've sent me. So this is May the Bridges I Burn. Light the way. I love the tags, I love the clothing. It's like a little riddle in a mall. So this says, so it's an XL and it's a Venom T-Pack halter neck in black. 
absolutely no desire to fit in. <laughs> I hope it bloody fits. So this is it, guys. And I just thought, I really, really like this. This would be nice with like my leather skirt and my leather pants. I've got wet look leggings. I've got some gothic pants. I've got all kinds of trousers that will go with this. Now it is a zip down, which I'm glad because I thought, hey, I'm going to fit my fat head in that. But it does zip down all the way down the middle, which is fab. It's a bit stiff at the minute. So it only zips down the neck so you can get the neck in. But guys, I think that will fit me. It's quite stretchy as well. Um, I don't know about my boobs fitting in that because I'm quite big chested, but it does stretch. So I reckon it'll be all right. Um, I'm not going to do a try on today, guys. So I have all my monitor and everything on. It's too much messing about. It's very cold here today. But if you do want to see a video of all the new things I've bought that I've not done a try on, pop a comment on below and I will do that maybe someday. So that was that, guys. I will link it below so you can see the price. It doesn't actually say anything about the price. But that was that one, guys. And last but not least, again, just to round it up to that £50, I'm going to keep that in here because I keep all my little labels in here and I keep my envelopes because I absolutely love them. The last thing I got, guys, was this Killstar... Um, Phone cover. As you know, I've pretty much got all the phone covers. I put one in a giveaway for you guys. And um, that's not up and running. I don't know if that's up and running yet. But wait for that one, you'll see it. So this is Book of Shadows phone cover. And this is for the iPhone 6. I have an iPhone 7. So yes, I know it doesn't fit my phone. But it might just fit my phone. But this is what it looks like, guys. If it doesn't fit, I know my daughter's got one of these phones and I know somebody else who's got an iPhone 6. But I'm just keeping these because I do actually just like them in general. And the box is perfect. So this was, I think it was $1.99, guys. These keep fluctuating up and down in price. But <coughs> $1.99 is not too bad. All right, guys, so that's my kill star. Tell me what you think. What was your favourite item? I know what my favourite item was and it's not even my items. I do love my bag. I will have a look at it in a minute and look at it properly. Now guys, this this may come very, very later on online because <laughs> Zach likes to watch my YouTube channel in his bedroom. So I've got to make sure that he don't see duality and Hydra because he he can understand what mummy says and he'll be like, yeah, get in. Right, let's put that back in there. Right guys, take care of yourself. Um, keep warm, keep dry and um, I'll see you very, very soon. Ring the bell if you haven't already. Take care and um, see you on the next one. Bye for now.